In the first episode of this two-part series, we have explored Venice on foot. Check the card on screen in case you missed that video. And in today's video, we are exploring the water aspect of this beautiful floating city. Let's go. Venice is a city of immense beauty and historical significance, but it is also unique and not like any other city in Italy. As a capital of the Veneto region of northern Italy, Venice actually lies on 117 small islands that are connected with a series of bridges and separated by a network of canals. Venice has literally hundreds of canals that connect the various islands that make up the city. The largest of them all is the Canal Grande. To truly experience Venice, you must experience it from the water. The Vaporetto is the main form of transport in Venice. It is one of the quickest ways of traveling to the various islands of Venice particularly in open waters beyond the walls of the city where the waters are too choppy for local gondola. However, for inland navigation and sightseeing, the small boats and the local gondolas fit right in. Personally, at 10 times the usual fare when compared to a water taxi, I would mark the gondola as an experience rather than a convenience or a means of transport. Okay, question. Looking at the price and the experience, which of the two do you think you're gonna choose? A gondola or a water taxi? Let me know in your comments. On that note, I conclude this video. I hope you enjoyed the Venice series. This was something new that I tried and some feedback would be nice. Thumbs up, thumbs down, depending on what you thought about it. If you haven't already, then please subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out on future uploads. As always, thanks for watching, keep exploring. This is Rahul and I'm gonna see you in the next one.